Breaking news, U.S. sanctions suppliers of precursor chemicals for fentanyl production. Welcome back, everyone. So happy to have you back for another update. Updated on the Treasury.gov website, April 14, 2023. The U.S. Department of the Treasury's Office of Foreign Assets Control, OFAC, designated two entities in the People's Republic of China and five individuals based in the PRC and Guatemala for supplying precursor chemicals to drug cartels in Mexico for the production of illicit fentanyl intended for U.S. markets. Now, drug precursors, also referred to as precursor chemicals, are substances which are known to be used in the illegal manufacturing of illicit drugs. Most precursors also have legitimate commercial uses, such as uh, in consumer products, such as medicine, flavorings, and fragrances. Illicit fentanyl is responsible for the deaths of tens of thousands of Americans each year, said the uh, Secretary of the Treasury for Terrorism. And this is the government's effort to apply these tools to prevent the transfer of precursor chemicals and machinery necessary to produce fentanyl. As a result of today's action, all property and interest in uh, property of the designated individuals and entities that are in the United States or in the possession or control of U.S. persons must be blocked and reported to the OFAC. In addition, any entities that are owned directly or indirectly, 50% or more by one or more black persons are also black. OFAC's regulations generally prohibits all dealings by U.S. persons or within the United States that involve any property or interest in the property of designated or otherwise block persons. Today's action is uh, in part of a whole uh, government effort to counter the global threat posed by trafficking of illicit drugs into the United States that is causing the deaths of tens of thousands of Americans annually, as well as countless more non-fatal overdoses. This action demonstrates the administration's uh, approach to saving lives by disrupting the traffic of illicit fentanyl and its precursors into American communities. This is so much needed 